Using strategies to subtract, lesson 2.9, it's going to be a review of all the strategies we've learned. We've learned many ways to subtract. We can use a 10 frame. We can think of an addition fact. We can count back. We can think of a double. We can use 10 to subtract 9. To count back, we start at the menu end, the large number, and we count back until we get to the subtrahen this number. So we start here and we count back until we get to that one. We see 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. It's 8 numbers. 14 minus 6 is 8. For 11 minus 8, we count back from the 11 until we get to 8. 10, 9, 8. That's 3 numbers. 11 minus 8 is 3. 14 minus 9 we start at the 14 and count back to the 9. 13, 12, 11, 10, 9. That was 5 numbers. 14 minus 9 is 5. 11 minus 5. We start at the 11 and count back until we get to the 5. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. That was 6 numbers. 11 minus 5 is 6. And 12 minus 8. We start at the 12 and count back until we get to the 8. 11, 10, 9, 8. It was four numbers. 12 minus 8 is 4. When we use doubles, we think of the addition sentence that uses doubles. 18 minus 9. 9 plus 9 equals 18. So it's missing a 9. 18 minus 9 is 9. And we think 8 plus 8 is 16. So the missing related double is 8. 6 plus 6 is 12, so the missing difference is 6. 5 plus 5 is 10, the missing difference is 5. And 7 plus 7 is 14, so the missing double is a 7. And we can use 10 or a 10 frame to subtract 9. Just remember 9 is 1 less than 10. If we have 17 minus 9, we have 17 dots, we cross off or remove nine of them, and we count how many we have left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Seventeen minus nine is eight. Fifteen minus nine, we have fifteen dots, and we cross off nine of them, and we've got one, two, three, four, five, six left. Thirteen minus nine, we have 13 dots, we crossed off 9 of them, and we've got 1 and 3 left. That's 4. 11 minus 9, we cross off 9 dots, and we have 1 and 1. That's 2. And we can think of an addition fact to subtract. For 10 minus 6, we think 6 plus 4 is 10. The missing related fact is a 4. 11 minus 4. We think that 4 plus 7 is 11, and the missing related fact is a 7. So 11 minus 4 equals 7. Now, if you need some more help with these, and you need to review these some more, there'll be links in this video's description to go back to those previous videos that taught about this in Chapter 1 and Chapter 2, mostly Chapter 2. Okay? So that's a review of all the ways that we've learned to subtract so far. All right? Keep practicing because you want to get good at subtraction. You want to just have someone give you the subtraction problem and you just know the answer right away like 1 plus 1 is 2. You want to go that fast. Okay? That takes practice. I'll see you next video. Bye.